Hello, welcome to this lesson where we are introducing algebra, which is uh, one of the simplest topics uh, on this part of algebra, grade 8s, grade 10s. Anyone who wants to, to get uh, acquainted with the basics of algebra can follow this lesson because this is the first lesson of algebra. This is the first lesson of algebra. Basically, we're just talking about algebra, but mainly what we're going to concentrate on are uh, integers, the rule of uh, signs. How do we add signs? Okay, same signs, different signs. Okay, so let's get started. So what are we supposed to do here? How do we simplify? Okay, as you can see, we are actually confining ourselves to the like terms. The like terms throughout what are we having? It's why. It's why, isn't it? So as long as the person doesn't have issues with, I mean, integers here, you cannot have challenges with this part. So, if we can start with the first one. 4y minus 2y plus 5y. So, I can even write this thing like this. And put the y that is common outside. So that we do not get distracted. Because maybe upon seeing y, you think something has gotten complicated. So... What are we supposed to do here? When you subtract here, when you simplify these two, what are you getting? You are getting 2 plus 5. And then you bring your y down. 4 minus 2, we are getting 2 plus 5. So then when we add this, what are we getting? 7y. So 7y is our answer for the first one. 7y is our answer for the first one. As simple as that. 7y is our answer for the first one. Okay? I don't have a problem. I can actually also come straight to this one. I can come to this one. What are we supposed to do here? We look at what is common. We get the coefficients. Then we leave our a, b squared alone outside there. We work out with these, like integers, which is taught in, we, integers we teach in integers in grade e, seven i think as well as grade eight so how do we add these okay you know here we've got two different signs so how do we simplify this we say you subtract the smaller number here then keep the sign of the larger number so we're going to get negative six plus eight minus six okay again we do the same thing here how do we simplify this we have different signs. So we are saying you subtract 6, which is a smaller number from 8, you are going to get 2. Then this 2 is going to have the sign of the bigger number, which is positive. Minus. Okay. What, what do we get when we subtract this one? We are getting minus 4. Simple as this one. This is basically what we are supposed to get. This is basically what we are supposed to get. Okay. Then... Let's proceed. Let us proceed. Let's look at this one. This one, the same thing. What is common? Two, I mean, uh, y is common. So we have 6 plus 10 minus 12 minus 14 plus 8 minus 1. Here the coefficient is 1. Open brackets y outside what do we do you simplify this one the first one what are you going to get you get minus 4 plus 10 minus 12 minus 14 plus 8 minus 1 you keep our y there this one we are simplifying integers basically when the signs are different we subtract the smaller number here what do we get we get 6 6 will keep the sign of the bigger number which will be positive minus 12 minus 14 plus 8 minus 1 okay then at this point what are we supposed to do again the same thing you subtract this 6 from 12 you're getting 6 6 will keep the sign of the bigger number which will be minus okay then minus we have minus 14 plus 8 minus 1 why here this we have both of them they are the same signs here yeah, we have the same sign isn't it when the sign is the same, you add them and keep the sign. So this is going to be 20 minus plus 8 
minus 1. What do we get? Y here. Again, this is the same thing. We're going to get minus 12, minus 1. What are we getting? Our 12 here. These ones, the sign is the same. So we're going to have minus 13 Y. Minus 13 Y will be our answer for this one. Minus 13 Y will be our answer here. Okay. Minus 13 Y will be our answer here. All right. So, what are we remaining with? We're remaining with these, these ones here. Okay. So, let's do the same thing. What are we supposed to have? 8 minus 10 plus 7 minus 1. Here, there's a minus 1 here. Why is a minus 1 here? What is common? X, Y. This is going to give us minus 2. I'm sure by now you are familiar with it. X, Y. What are we supposed to get here? 5 minus 1. X, Y. When the signs are different, you subtract the smaller number from the larger number, which will be 5. Then the 5 will keep the sign of the larger number. So this gives us what? 4 x, y. This is our answer here. Alright? We do the last one. Do the last one. Do the last one. Here, what is common? What is common is x squared minus 5 plus 12 minus 20. We we'll keep our x squared there. So this is going to give us 2 plus, okay? So here I can say, when we subtract here, what are we getting? We're going to get 2. When we get 2, 2 plus 12, we're going to get 14. 14 minus 20, x squared. What do we get here? Minus 6. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. It's x squared, isn't it? x squared. This is what is going to be our answer. This is what is going to be our answer. I was only introducing you to basics of algebra. And if you noticed, the algebra was only the later part. But uh, basically, we're dealing with integers. Okay. Now, you cannot, in case you have something like this one, or, you know, this is going to give us 0. This is 6 minus 6, we're going to get 0. So you can't write 0 x squared. No. You know that when you multiply 0 by anything, you get 0. So this will be 0 just. Even this one will just be 0. That will be your answer. You can't have 0xy. No. 0 is 0. Alright? That is that. That is that. And I thought I should introduce you to this part. Now, our tradition is that we do give an exercise at the end of each and every short lesson. Okay? So, let's look at this exercise as our exercise is here. Simplify. A, we're having B squared, I mean A squared minus 2, uh, minus 2A squared plus 7A squared. B having X, 7XY minus 9XY plus 12XY minus 30XY. And um, C, we have... Uh, 8m minus 12m minus m minus 4m plus 5 plus 15m plus 15m uh, d which is the last one we can have uh, 13xyz minus 20xyz plus uh, 20xyz, okay, um, minus, uh, minus 13, or minus 4xyz, then minus 
13 xyz then plus 4 xyz all right that is your exercise that is your exercise there all right thank you